Hello everybody, my name is Alex and I wish you a warm and cozy welcome to the Bartown SMP server. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, so, if you don't know what Bartown SMP server is, well I've got to tell you. So basically this is a server, whitelisted one, um, hosted and founded by Barty, Mr. Barty. Um, after whom this whole thing is um, named, Bart Town. And we're basically a little community of uh, 15 guys or so. Um, smaller YouTubers, like of my size, a little bigger, a little smaller, um, that kind of thing. And um, yeah, we're, we're playing on this um, vanilla survival server. And there's also an FTB server, which I don't think I'm going to be playing on too soon. But yeah, we'll, we'll see about that. Um, but yeah, <laughs> so basically this map has been reset, um, shortly before I joined the server because I'm fairly mm. new compared to a lot of the others. Um, so I was one of the three people that have, um, joined, um, during the contests, um, that took place before the 1.6 update. Um, so I joined, Peer joined, that's another guy, and Rio. And... Yeah, so this is spawn or near spawn because this right here will be my future place. Although we're actually playing on this server for like two or three weeks, I have not managed to set up anything right here. I don't know. I ju just didn't do it. <laughs> I kind of don't have a clear idea of what I want to do here. So yeah, that's kind of the thing about that. Um, I can show you my stuff. Yeah, that's amazing. Um, that's the cool things. And there is some other random crap. So yeah, actually gotta make a little axe quickly because I don't have one. And then we're gonna head off on the spawn and look what people have done there. Actually, I'm gonna take the birch wood. Okay, that there and that up there. Okay, so we're gonna head towards this stuff up there. <laughs> this is actually an airship. Um, me and a few others have been building. Uh, yes, we're not exactly happy with it, and I think we're gonna tear it down again if we have the time for it. Uh, otherwise, we're just gonna burn it down Hindenburg style. But yeah, we'll see about that. Um, this is where, <laughs> where Bardi, the, the server founder um, guy, <laughs> is currently setting up home kind of building such a, such a tower thing here, which is cool. Um, up there, uh, there's going to be some sort of monumental thing. <laughs> I'm not too sure about that. Um, they did something like that in the old server, and I kind of missed that. I don't know what exactly they're talking about. I, I didn't watch too much of the old server. So, yeah. Um, further down the road, what we have to the left here is whose place? Free Pierce Place, so that's um, another one of the three new guys, as said. <laughs> there we go. Um, oh, back here. I haven't seen this yet. Which place is this? No. No sign around here. No idea. <laughs> no idea who that is. Oh, uh, okay. And. What else? I think back. Oh, <laughs> yeah. There we go. This is the 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 track, which we're gonna come back to later. No idea who put that stuff in, but I think this is where Andrew is gonna set up. Skeleton over here. Let's shoot him in the face. Yeah. There you go. Sniper skeleton. Okay. So that's that. Um. Oh my gosh, world, please load. Um, and I think right here is where Bubble. <laughs> bubble. Uh, brownish Bubble, I think his name is. Uh, is about to do stuff. So, yeah, that's that. Um, this massive monumental thing right here. Um, which is a sheep farm. As you might hear. Um, has been started to build, I should say, by Admiral Redstone. So he 
does this thing. Although it's kind of messy yet because those <laughs> pens are kind of messed up, you know. Um, but we have 16 pens right here and they're going to be filled if we do it that way with all um, different kinds of um, sheep colors. So that's cool. And then he's planning on doing a, a canopy thing out of leaves up there. So I think that's going to turn out quite nicely. Sorry for a quick cut. Um, this here is Taro's Pumpkin, blah, pumpkin Pie Factory. Work in progress, as you can see. Although, this is the Pumpkin Pie Factory, and I think this here is going to be a sugar cane farm. Or something like that. Yeah. Um, and back there, he is building his house. Or has built. Because I think it's finished, although the interior does kind of look not finished. <laughs> Taro's house, there we go, he has a little tree farm going right next to the gigantic sugarcane skyline here. So that's cool. Um, and yeah, up there you can nicely see those those balloons. I've never seen it from this angle here, it looks kind of nice. Uh, I'm actually going to head up here. This is a temporary um, rail station. But again, we're going to take a look at the rails in a little bit. Take a look at the balloons now. Yeah, there we go. Quite nice at night. So, yeah, that's that. Um, just build those for decoration. I think we're going to somehow set up a nether portal up in the airship, which I talked about earlier, um, or maybe in one of the balloons, if we um, screw the airship idea. There's an enderman, which I'm going to take down, because I only have one single enderman. <laughs> and we might have some more if we're... Um, Oh, damn it. I'm gonna die here. <laughs> Shit. Oh my gosh. Ah, ooh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, be right back. Alright, there we are. Notice the sound was way too high. Although I think I turned it down like several times already. Don't know what's up with that. <laughs> Let's collect our stuff. I think the Enderman is gone somewhere. I don't know. Oh no, my. Oh. Damn it! <laughs> oh, I had 36 levels, man. Ah, screw you, Enderman. I'm gonna teach your friends when we get to the end. I'm gonna teach your friends. Oh, God damn it. Alright, so, um, I was talking about this earlier. You get lost. Now. <coughs> Shut up. <coughs> Shut up. And yeah, so I was talking about airship things, so we're gonna put the ender portal, which is right here somewhere. I haven't been to the nether yet, so we're gonna do that in another, another part of either this or another video. Um, this, however, is Acro Pat's place, as the sign says, or just Acro, or Pat, whatever. And this, I think, is where Rio, I think this here is where Rio is setting up. Uh, let me take a look. There's a sign. Yeah, there we go. Rio. That's dangerous because there's no water down there. Um, so, what else? This here um, is Pounce's place. He is building this house right now. Um, he also has this um, little mine thing down here where he usually was. Oh, used to be. That's more what I was saying. This, I think, Noah built, which I think looks really nice. Uh, I really like this this, this mushroom-style thing here. Looks cool. Love it. Um, Big-ass weed farm. <laughs> looks fantastic. Um, yeah, so much about that. Um, back there, we're going to quickly tear down that ladder, because we don't need it there. Um, and then I'm going to show you the whole real thing. Get lost ladder. Okay, and we'll take that out as well. Okay, so back here we have one of um one of the four outer stations of which one and a half are built. Oh, rear joint. Damn it, spider. <laughs> Just to let him know. 
Oh, okay. Where zombie be? There zombie not be. There spider be. However, um, this is the way to get up into the swamp station. This here is um, the redstone mechanics down here. Um, and up here we have the station, which is not entirely finished yet. So we gotta put in some booster rails right here, which we didn't have at first. Um, and yeah, maybe something up there. I'm not too sure. So the whole rail system um i had kind of the idea to do that because i thought it would be really nice if um god damn it world reload okay so i had the idea to do um a quick transport and travel system in the spawn area so that you can easily get around um like if you're at that end where my place is you want to quickly get to the middle and can just hop in the station and you'll easily be there um, that way you can, <laughs> and that way you can, you can easily, um, yeah, quickly get around and you don't have to walk all the time if you just forgot something or whatever. Um, and that's, that's nice. And also it looks really cool. I think it gives a nice structure and kind of divides into four districts. And also it gives you a cool view from above when you're riding along the track, um, to, to just <laughs> to just overlook um, the whole spawn area. So that's cool. Okay. Um, so this station is set is not set up yet, so we're gonna head on and uh, go to the central station, which is set up fully yet. It, that, would, that made no sense. Which is already fully set up. <laughs> so we have this station, which is practically uh, finished. We get a tree station, which is just temporary, but actually works and we have nothing there and nothing in that direction because um over in that direction um admiral still has to do the the track through the canopy we kind of planned that out somehow and there is some rail uh, some rails missing oh no just yeah empty cars they don't travel oh my gosh there's so many cards here what the hell um the empty ones are um not going the full way because they are less heavy um, we're gonna take them back to the main station where we can put them back into the system. Um, let me do that real quick. One belongs here, another one there. I'm gonna throw one in there, another one in there. Preferably not in the cactus. Okay, so let me get my bread. The way this works is fairly simple and that is what it is intended to do because we want to just hop in here head off into whatever direction we want so what we do is we just hop in this pressure plate hop in the minecart and off we go that's all and the new minecart is dispensed back there although the dispenser might have been empty ah damn it cart <sighs> no <laughs> and we can just head back there and see what it did I think there was no minecart in the system, that's what we didn't see one. Maybe it was just out of range. Man, this is tired. Yeah, there was no minecart in the system, that's why. Yeah, there's just a single one. Um, maybe we should take one from here. <laughs> Put it there. Because we should always have two minecarts in there, at least. There we go. Uh, one, obviously, we have to put on the track. There we go. I'm gonna quickly check the others. Oh, this one has plenty. Okay, put that there. Um, how much is this one? Oh, oh, that that one has a lot. I can take one from there. And this one. Okay, can put one in there. Okay, so the arrival part we can also quickly take a look at. Um. Step on the pressure plate, hop in the minecart, off you go. So to turn down the volume there. It's really loud for me. I know. Previous recordings were screwed up because it was too loud. <laughs> so let me avoid that in this one. Okay, I said this one is just temporary. Oh, goddammit. Getting some lag issues. Okay, and off we go in the other direction so that you can see how the arrival part um, looks. 
with the whole cactus business. So, right against it, and my card gets sucked up and back into the system. Yep, that's about it. That's how that works. So, um, I think that should be enough talking about the the whole what is there right now and introduction stuff. <laughs> um, so what we're gonna do now is head over to the swamp where I started setting up a zombie spawner system. And if you're subscribed to me uh, since a few days or longer, um, you might know that I just recently came up with a um, zombie spawner two in one system which allows you to um, have one zombie spawner and um, combine in one system you have an XP grinder as well as a, um, a purifier system. So that's cool, we're gonna build that because we do need some villagers around to build some some iron farm stuff and so on and we can collect XP and loot there and yeah that's gonna be cool so be right back when I got my stuff there. Okay. Okay, there we are. <laughs> um, not yet that the uh, um, zombie spawner system. We might do that later today. Um, maybe together with Barty or, uh, and or Admiral Redstone. So we'll see about that. Um, we're, we're definitely going to do it. Um, I, I'll definitely do it. If I have to, I'll do it myself. Um, but as you might see, I get a bunch of levels down there. Um, and I went caving. Yeah, I went like three hours caving just <laughs> right now. <laughs> and yeah, I got some iron there. We can take out. Yep, you saw it. We have some horse armor right here. And I just noticed that, it, that we have three of them. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Did only found those two type, uh, the iron type, I mean. But yeah, here you can see we got a bunch of lapis, a bunch of redstone, a whole bunch of coal. Because I really, I, I literally mined like every single um, vein of coal I found. <laughs> um, gold, not that much, but it's okay. Um, also a lot of iron, really, that's a whole lot. I found so many emeralds, like so many, <laughs> it's insane, I found so many emeralds. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, well, there we go. <laughs> Hey, you must have burned because I put that lava there, so we have some here if we need it for something. <laughs> and you must have burned. Okay, and a bunch of diamonds, and I found a single saddle. I found like, um, let's say ten, um, dungeons and fifteen um, minecart chests, uh, at least. And in the the second last minecart chest I checked, I found this saddle. Like I got three horse armor, six name tags, and um, I got those two records. Although I found actually way more, but I only took one of uh, one of a kind uh, out of space reasons. But one single saddle. <laughs> oh man! But let's not complain about that, um, because what we're gonna do is put that iron there and craft ourselves some stuff. We need, yeah, I think that's plenty. And that, none of that. Um, what we're gonna do is enchant some stuff because I do not want to lose those levels again like I did last time. So yeah, um, we're gonna do one of that. And uh, now we're gonna make a shovel. I'm gonna make uh, another diamond pick, and we're gonna do a diamond sword. Yep. Okay. So let me quickly head over to the enchanting table, which I think we should really get ourselves one too. I um, haven't gotten around to doing that yet though. But yep, yeah, be right back. Man, I'm getting one weird glitch right here. I don't know if that's causing my, uh, caused by my computer or whatever, but, but look, I, I'm left clicking right now and it does what it would do with a right click and I cannot do standard left click which means I cannot even attack I can't even break something don't know if that's a glitch in the latest snapshot which would be awesome <laughs> um, or if it's yeah I said computer based but anyway so I cannot even attack that uh, that skeleton there let me get in there real quick <laughs> okay so I'm doing that all with left click right now 
Okay, and we're gonna put that there. I'm gonna put a 30 on there. Well, that's that's tough. <laughs> damn it. Oh, damn it. That was... Oh, that was a 15. That was... Uh, I'm not gonna do that with my bad luck right now. Nope. Screw that. Oh my gosh, that's the worst. Ah! And now that. Okay. Be right back. Okay, so Nether Fortress is right down there. I'm totally... Shortly before rage quitting because back in the swamp with our nice pig. Well, I uns like I, I, I dismounted it because um, I was getting shot at and it was kind of Kind of hard to, to defend myself because I didn't have too many arrows and um, Yeah, I dismounted and forgot to kill the pig to get a saddle back So I now am left with three saddles. I took one um and because I'm like, ugh, I could not find any horse, man. This is so bad. I'm just gonna take one from here. But no, I seem to notice that they've all been taken. Oh. Well, that's awesome. <laughs> Quickly lagged back there. Um, hmm. Well, Pat told me that I could take one of his horses that wouldn't be settled already. But they're all saddled and mounted. Man, that's weird. Because I was here already and... And, and there were... <laughs> what is up with that? Is, is it, are they back there? Where are those freaking horses? No, they're not back there. Oh my gosh, he has all his bulls back there. <laughs> what does he have in there? Okay. This game does not want to have. This doesn't want to have me horse. Ah, oh, screw. <laughs> okay, uh, so I'm here with Pat, and he went with me through like uh, 500 blocks in the Nether. <laughs> I totally lost. We're out. You can see how far we're out. Like crazy crazy far out and um, yeah he's currently leading me towards a plains biome where he found some horses and we'll see if we can get one there um, he's actually gonna ride one back with me so that's beautiful um, so that w we can have two um, that way we can breed them and get as many as we want preferably we would take um, a donkey and the regular one so let's see about that. Is there donkeys? Oh, mm. <laughs> ah. ah, too bad. That's rep. Let me write here. <laughs> okay, so what were what which one are we gonna choose let me let me take a look um hmm yeah okay so seems like we're just gonna take a random one maybe um okay so i'll i'll quickly choose a few and then we can write back through the portal <laughs> Okay, so it seems like Acropat, or I'm just gonna call, and call ah, I'm just gonna call him Pat, is currently fighting with this horse. There we go. Um, so yeah, I, I'm just decided to take a white and a black horse, as there are no donkeys around, and we can breed them to get whatever we like. <laughs> no fire resist. Yeah, I, I'm currently lagging quite bad. <laughs> We're gonna make it through the nether. Took all my good stuff with me for some... Oh, there we can go in there. That's swiftness. Okay. And... 
Great, okay, we're gonna head in, it seems like. I got a lead, which is awesome. Did he? <laughs> what did he do? Uh, let me get in there. <laughs> I, I didn't even dismount my horse. Ah. That is one bad spot to spawn. Oh, and... <laughs> <laughs> and yeah we should definitely get rid of lava uh, and I don't have another saddle uh. <sighs> okay I got a real lock because I once again got this super stupid um, right mouse button effect uh, gotta relock. Okay, be right back. Okay. Oh, there's a guest. <laughs> right when I start recording. Seems like we made it. Whoop. Ah, damn it. Seems like it. Uh, seems like we made it safely back here. Um, although the horses got lit on fire a few times, but we healed the bag up, so. They should be okay now. And we're just about near spawn. <laughs> yeah, random hit. Yeah, we're, we're just around the spawn portal. Um, should be somewhere down there. And if nothing goes wrong right now, we should actually be able to have two horses now, finally. <laughs> Final bridge. Uh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, that's it. Um, are we gonna make this? Come on, horses. Because there's lava below. We probably shouldn't be going as fast about this. Uh, hold back, horse. Hold back. Are you gonna. <laughs> Get through it. Oh, Geronimo! <laughs> he walks like <laughs> all slow and nicely. And now there he comes. Oh, oh, damn it. We're gas. <laughs> oh, no, I didn't want to jump on you. Yes. And two gases now, seriously. Ah. Oh, I'm so bad at bow shooting right now. Ah, there. Whew. <laughs> we made it. Oh, oh, not yet. <laughs> and I have no arrows left. Oh, gotta go. Gotta go. Get in here, freaking horse. Ah. <laughs> no, let's get the hell out of here. The hell out of here. Yeah. We're the hell out of there. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay, so that much about the horses. <laughs> Where's the other one? Wait a second, that would Ah, there we have it. Yes. Oh, and I'm okay. And I can't see Pat. <laughs> okay. Okay, so maybe I went a little overboard telling I would um work out the, the whole zombie spawner system with you guys today. I oh hey Tarbo. <laughs> A lot of people just joined, so we're we're four right now, which is cool. Um, yeah, um, we're, we're not gonna do it today, but I'm very sure that we're going to take a look at it in the next episode. That actually um, started it already with Tarot together, um, so we're we're already done with a part of it, with the whole zombie spawner project. Um, so I'll I'll try my best to get out the next episode as um, fast as possible, 
and I would say I by the way just took the engineering table right here or I just made one but I just screwed up the recording because my mute button was pressed and yeah <laughs> so I chant this pick which is cool um, but yeah and then I would say <laughs> oh man it's, it's getting late here I'm, I'm kinda tired and I would say if you liked it please make sure to leave a rating and comment as always and if you're new to the crew then maybe consider leaving a subscription so that you will always get notified of my uploads and um, yeah I'd say I hope you're on with us again next time and until then bye bye